that's who's there. You know, hopefully things, hopefully things change around here. We have a new mayor. Hopefully things change around here and they're not run the same that they've been run for the past decades. As someone with zoning experience as a manager here in the New England area, I find this ludicrous. How can they get all the way through zoning and ZBA approval, site plan approval, and not have any documentation for the testing that was allegedly done? It, it only speaks to it, their application and approval only speaks to it in a you know, perspective sense. Interestingly enough, the soup kitchen was there for a while, it moved. Has the EPA done a study? Because it would be serious if there was contamination there. You remember Ira Novoselsky. He's the city councilor that didn't want to talk to me about contamination at 525 Beach Street, even though he's part of the committee that was responsible for the testing and present at a meeting almost a year ago where um, they alleged the testing was being completed. Well, well what happened then? So are you Ira Novoselsky? Yes. I was just wondering, do, are you familiar with any contamination going on at 525 Beach Street in that building there? No, I have no comment on that. No comment on that. Contamination, sir. Has the EPA done a study or anything of that nature? Do you know? Sir? Has the EPA done a study? Because it would be serious if there was contamination there. I mean, that would, I mean if, gonna, if they're going to build on that, that'd be pretty serious, right? Oh, and you best believe I've reached out to everyone here. You know, just looking for an answer. And through the miracle of social networking, you know, I can only put the word out so that everyone knows that they need to provide an answer. That's all.